Guys, what is up everybody? Welcome back to Stashcraft. Today in this video, I'm reviewing the chair that I'm using. I won't say it's the best chair. I won't say it's the cheapest chair. I will say it is the chair that I'm using and I really, really enjoy. Um, and that would be the One Tigris. I think like, the official name is the One Tigris Promenade 2 or something like that. Um, I actually, my girlfriend bought for this for me when I was going on one of my uh, annual tours for the Air Force, went out to Hawaii and uh everybody wanted to sit in my chair uh mostly because they didn't have one and i was smart enough to bring one but also because it was so comfortable uh, i do like this chair again i think there are smaller chairs i think there are lighter chairs but this one weighs in at about 2.4 pounds i believe um the dimensions you know here's like my forearm uh i don't know the exact measurements i'll put them probably like right here uh and i think it holds up to 330 pounds so you can be a bigger size individual and still fit in this chair weight wise. Um, it's very easy to set up, it, uh, very easy to take down. Um, there's only one part that you kind of have to use a little bit of strength to get to the back of the chair on. Um, but everything fits in this pack. Uh, you open it up, obviously you have the backing of the chair, the chair part itself, and then you have the frame. Um, I believe it's an aluminum frame. Uh, it looks intimidating at first until you realize that everything just kind of fits into the little holes that they're attached to, uh, just like this. <clears throat> See if I can back up a little bit. And then there you are. The frame of the chair is set up just that quick. This will be a pretty easy video. Um, like I said, the only part of this chair that I would say is maybe a downside is uh, getting the fourth corner on. So the first three are very, very easy. Um, they kind of just slide into the, uh, the little notches down here, um, but it's the fourth one that you may have to use a little bit of muscle, but even then, not that bad. And your chair's set up, okay? Um, I'm about 5'10", 200-ish pounds. Um, and you can see I fit pretty comfortably. Uh, I know they recently came out, I don't want to say recent, I don't know when, but I know they've evolved this chair into a, a high back chair. Um, and I think it doesn't, like these sides on that chair are a little bit more flayed out so your arms sit a little bit more comfortably. Um, if you see, let me wrap this thing around. Um, it can kind of like rub maybe the bottom of your triceps a little bit, but uh, I just kind of tuck my arms in and here you are. Um, so this is the One Tigris Promenade 2, I believe. I think it's around, I saw it for like $60 on the website, I'm pretty sure. Um, but I think you can find it cheaper elsewhere. I think I looked and it was $40 at Walmart. Um, I'll put you a few links in the description below. But as you can see, this chair was super easy to set up and it's equally as easy to take down, if not easier, because it requires uh, a lot less muscle. And then obviously you just do everything you did to put it together, but in reverse, right? So collapse all these down, bada bing, bada boom. Uh, I can't say enough good things about this chair. I have very little uh, bad things to say. One thing I didn't mention is it, almost because they're a little irrelevant. Um, there are pockets on each side. I'll show them to you here in a second. Uh, but this frame, as you can see, fits real easily back in the bag. Uh, on the outside of the chair, there are two pockets. I don't know. Phones are so big now, I guess you could maybe fit it in there a little bit. It barely fits my hand. Uh, and when you sit in it, they kind of push pretty tight. So you're not going to fit a whole lot. That's why I say they're almost irrelevant. Uh, I've never used them before. Um, but then to put this back, it can kind of fit in any which way. I mostly just fold it up, shove it in, and then uh, zip it back up. Just like that, the uh, One Tigress is back in its pouch and you're ready to go. It does have a little bit of, I don't know, molly or little little straps in here that you could maybe lay something through to cinch it down to your, your pack or whatever a little bit better. Um, two carrying handles, and then that's basically it. It's simple. I love this chair. Uh, let me know what chair you guys are using. 
like I said, this one's about 2.4 pounds, uh, can hold up to about 330 pounds of weight. So very sturdy, uh, comfortable. Again, let me know what, in the comments what kind of chair you guys are using or whatever one you recommend. Um, I am looking for one that maybe packs down a little bit smaller, uh, just because this one was kind of hard to fit in my uh, my Kestrel 48 pack. Not hard, but it just takes up a little bit more room than I than I uh, would like. So, anyways, one Tigris. Okay, if you enjoyed this review and you want to see more, I'm learning more about backpacking every single day, more about camping and just outdoor gear shit. So again, sorry for swearing, but. Uh, like and subscribe if you want to see future videos. It uh, really helps me. It really helps the channel. So I appreciate you guys, and we'll see you in the next one.